Hey guys, what is going on? This is Travis P11. I'd like to welcome you back to the channel. And today we're going to talk about my Popov, the traditional wallet as it's called. So this wallet was sent to me about the middle part of May of 2019. About every year or two, I have people that ask me to do an update and request to see how well it's holding up. Well, I am happy to say that the wallet is holding up just fine. The model that I have here is called the traditional. When Popov Leather sent this to me back in 2019, I think it was around $79. Uh, these wallets have now gone up to about $109. So a couple things I want to say real quick. Uh, first of all, you do get free shipping on anything over $75. Uh, there is a discount code still available at the company. I'll check and see if my original discount code is still there. Uh, if it's not, then again, I'm just not going to put it in this video. Um, they are featuring 20% off on your first order if you've never ordered from them before or if it's been a while since you've ordered. Uh, punch in an email address, they will send you a 20% off coupon. And they are doing 25% off for Mother's Day, I believe, handbags. And so we'll talk about what Popov now has to offer. Now, I'm not being endorsed by these guys. I'm not receiving any promotion. I don't even have an affiliate code or any kind of bonuses. But let's talk about the wallet in general. What do you need to know about it, uh, the materials, the color, the style, and so on. So I'll show you a picture of what this looks like on the website versus how mine is right now. And I'll put a link to the previous video so you can go back and see how this wallet has aged over the last four years. It is a wallet I have in my pocket daily, and I am happy to say, that it has not broken, it has not split, it has not fallen apart, it still smells fantastic, uh, it still holds everything like it does before, the pockets are still nice and tight, you can put up to around two cards per pocket, which is a good thing. I really do think that it is worth it, and back in the day at 80 bucks, I, I think it was a, a great value, and at $109, it's getting a little bit steep, but I don't know about you guys, but if you haven't priced some of those high-tech, you know, carbon fiber, titanium, well, I guess people call them wallets that people are wearing these days. Uh, you know, those aren't exactly cheap either. So real quick, what is the uh, the traditional, as it's called, uh, wallet have to offer? So just taking you right over to the Popov website, they've got a five card wallet, a traditional wallet, a trifold wallet, money clip wallet. Uh, you know, they've got all kinds of different models and types. Uh, you can get a style, you can get a like, a like a pocketbook style with a chain if you want to. A coin wallet, very, very, very cool. Now, they are made in Canada, uh, but before that turns people off, I do want to say that they do use American USA sourced cow hides, which I think is a good thing. Uh, myself, who has a family that's involved in the cattle industry, that's a good thing. They could be getting their uh, hides from other places, but they choose to use American leather, which I think is a good thing. Uh, like I said before, 25% off all totes, my bad, but they do have wallets, belts, totes, shoes, watch bands, office, travel, and accessories. So they have a, a pretty decent selection over at popoffleather.com. All right, so back to my wallet. It is the traditional and specific features of the wallet, according to the website, made from USA full grain leather, a durable leather that will develop a rich patina over time, which it is. Uh, lifetime guarantee, um, hand sewn with durable tiger thread. It says it will never unravel or come apart. And the edges are holding up really well. Again, none of the threads have busted out. It's not splitting. Uh, definitely great value for the money. Uh, burnished and polished edges show attention to detail in our work. Six card slots that can fit at least two cards in each pocket, never run out of room. Uh, billfold pocket holds a stack of cash, works well with American, Canadian, and UK currency. Uh, 4.3 inches wide, 3.3 uh, inches tall, and 0.5 of an inch thick. I thought maybe they made some different styles depending on what currency you have. And check it out, guys. We actually have something in the wallet this time. There's real money in here. So it's taken me four years, but it's finally happened. Look, oh my gosh, there's business cards. Holy cow. So anyway, guys, uh, yeah, it is holding up really well. I'm very happy with it. It has had just a few little nicks and scratches and a few little burrs and marks in it, but they seem to kind of self-heal and just darken over time. In fact, it had kind of a large crease in it when I first got it, and that has long since disappeared. Um, breaking on this, it does take a little bit of time, but this is just how it ages. This is what it does. It's going to mold around, essentially, whatever you stuff in it. If you check out any other long-term re reviews of the Pop-Off Leather Wallet, you kind of see them aging about the same way. Now, the only sad thing about this is that this is considered a dad wallet, kind of like dad shoes, you know, Skechers, or a dad bod. I will say this, dad, uh, go ahead and take that little tiny titanium carbon fiber thing you call a wallet. Take your family to the mall and tell me if you got a place to stuff all those receipts, all those validation tickets, all those credit card applications. You know what, man? You can stuff them all right here, right? That's what you can do with it. So the traditional wallet, very hard to beat. Yeah, it's a dad wallet, but you know what? I don't care. I love it. I'm going to keep using it, and I'm going to keep giving you guys updates, and if it does fall apart, 
part, I will definitely let you guys know. So I think that's pretty much about it. I want to thank you guys for watching. This is my little four year update of uh, the traditional wallet. And I don't mind it being so clunky and big or whatever. It doesn't really bother me. Um, it just, you know, it's going to be as thick as whatever you basically put in it. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. I want you to like and subscribe. Uh, make sure you check out a little podcast that I do called Caliber Corner, which happens Saturday mornings at 8 a.m. over here on YouTube. Uh, that's 8 a.m. Central Time. We talk guns and ammo, outdoorsy stuff and so on. Uh, again, if I do have any kind of a discount code, I'll post in the description box. I'll also put a, a, a link for this particular wallet, which, you know, like I said, it's gone up to $109 now. But free shipping if you spend $75. Bucks. Uh, again, handcrafted by a small shop up in Canada. And again, I don't mind giving them the business. So in the meantime, guys, I want you to have fun. I want you to be safe. Go get yourself a wallet. Oh, by the way, Father Day is coming up. They might just have a special maybe coming up in May or June. And uh, we will talk to you soon. All right, take care and have a good one. All right, bye-bye.